want to see what's gonna happen here. Oh no, I apologize. I'm running into a small error. Hold on. I believe the, I believe the match is still ongoing. There was some mis. That was this is the first time. Do you know where? You will get to the audience. And I could watch the. No, you're good. Okay, it's cool. All right, all right. Yeah. Cool. Without further technical difficulties, uh, let's go PA Dream here and Monty. Of course, Monty is not the first time that we've actually seen Monty before. We've had the pleasure of having Monty at a different ladder as well. Yeah, I've uh, seen this game watch a few times now. This matchup, I was curious. Uh, I was really curious about the up B out of shield for for Game & Watch in this type of matchup. Oh, the roll call out though, damn. Big read there. I was just curious what uh, Dr. Mario is gonna do to like get in on Game & Watch safely without getting up beat out of shield, but uh, Dream is playing around pretty well, but yeah, very little he can do in that situation. I don't even know if he still had his double jump there. Uh, Game & Watch can edge guard that really easy. Dr. Mario's recovery, one of his biggest weaknesses. Oh. Getting juggled by up air, you don't you don't ever want to be in that position. The game watch is directly under you. Nice combo. It's big. I think the thing too with game watch being so light and actually pretty easy to combo. Uh, yeah, Dream's gonna really get rewarded off for just getting a few you know good punishes. As you can see, those pills are also really good. Uh, he can use the bucket to reflect them, but not be able to actually get a full bucket from it is really good because if, if those pills hit okay, dr mario gets a lot of combos even kill setups from it yeah that's the yeah. thing too it's it, dr mario is a slower heavier more knockback version of mario weaker recovery but and when you think about his kill power it kind of balances out unfortunately though on that neutral air up smash will be the one thing that he has to worry about because game and watch up smash is still as it's not as good as it was in smash 4 but it's still definitely something to remember yeah, very, very good uh, anti-air move. Now getting juggle here, using the cape just to you know, reflect those up airs a little bit, make his recovery a little bit easier back to the ground. Oh no, oh. yeah, Shaft no berry. down smash, no berry though. Alright, Dream looking for an opportunity just to kind of get around Monty, and honestly as he should, you're looking more to get some escape. Uh, you can tell the that, map. yeah, you gotta be careful. Yeah, you gotta watch the landing, and that's the thing too. For Dr. Mario, in a situation where you kind of just fight to put him off stage, Dr. Mario's landing tools aren't as good as Mario's because of the way his weight works. So unfortunately for Dream, he's kind of in a really rough spot at this high percent. If he goes off the stage at a wrong time, expect Monty to definitely punish that. He's already got the anti-air on deck, so this puts PH Dream in an underwear, in an underwear state where I have to really watch out. His recoveries have been incredible though. He's only gotten edge guarded once and he's like either teching like these stage spikes or just saving his double jump at the right time. Actually very, very good uh, play from Dream. Unsafe downer there. He actually can't afford to do that again because I do know that up B out of shield from Doc is incredibly strong. Uh, and it can kill pretty soon. Almost dying to up smash. Rage Dr. Mario very scary right now. Oh, uh, yeah. Gotta be careful. Everything Monty next... has. Oof. Oh, yeah. Uh, no, yeah. yeah. You can't up be out of shield. Is it, it... He knew that it would kill there, but you have to do the right. Uh, you have to do the right move that you can actually punish with that. And that, that wasn't it. I think he was expecting him to do a more unsafe move on his shield, so he was already like buffering the up B. But. Yeah, he, he did it against forward air, which, you know, that's super safe. Yeah. I, I like the idea, though. The idea was there. He had to come back if he got that up B to work. Um, and I honestly don't even... I can't really say what he needs to change. He played incredibly well. He just made one mistake at the end. I, I could easily see this going to game three. And obviously, if you're this far as Doc, you probably just main Doc. Like, <laughs> you could always pick a better character, and I'm sure if he did have a better character, he would play them. Yeah. But, yeah, I want to see uh, Doc go the distance, for sure. I 
definitely enjoy playing Doc a lot more than Mario in this game. He's a very satisfying character to to play with. Let's see. Let's see, where are we going here? Dreams kind of pick. Okay, I'll... Uh, this makes sense. It's uh, not too like nonsense, like pretty, pretty average stage pick here. I just don't want to see Dream get platform trapped. I think that's the big thing he has to be careful with when picking the stage. Game Watch's juggles are very oppressive. Ooh, we throw grab range. Those stubby little arms. Ooh, wow, great parry. Yeah, that looked like arms. that looked like that uh, up smash was just going to guarantee connect. But yeah, oh. super dead here. Yeah, yeah, I was gonna say you're too far off the stage in that situation. Yeah, Dr. Mario. Even if he were to try to make an attempt at a recovery, it would he would only recover because Monty dropped it. Yeah. Oh, going for the Judgment Hammer too. That's like one way to just immediately steal all momentum your opponent can hope to get. <laughs> like you oh, kill yeah. them and then immediately get a nine on their next stock. That's where it hurts the most, man. Like you already took, you're already losing, but now you're losing even more, and your opponent has the ego boost from getting the nine on you. Yeah. Dream, dropping a lot of these ledge traps. Uh, he's just like a little bit off on his timings, and it's actually costing him a lot. Oh no! Watch the into it. That's Not sure. That's Not the, sure what he was yeah. thinking. He the fell for his own trick. The last <laughs> time Dream rolled in, it was a down smash. And even though he didn't get buried, you still have to respect Demon Watch. He's charging. He's literally charging up smash. You have enough time to let go of the ledge. Just normal get up. Yeah. And punish that with the pill. But nonetheless, your Dream is one stock deficit. I mean, last game was pretty close. So we'll see if Dream can kind of slowly clutch things out. Yeah. He didn't really have this big of a deficit last time. But like I said before, uh, Game Watch super light. Doc hits like a truck. So it's not completely impossible uh, for this to become an even match very soon. I want to say, like, within, go, well, yeah, he can die now. <laughs> oh, no punish on the ledge option. And he's really just been struggling to keep uh, Mont Monty at the ledge. Oh, or even, no. even read his ledge options in general. Yeah, and you can tell that's where Dream was kind of going for it. Dream tried oh, to space himself for an up smash or a back air, but unfortunately, none of those will connect while narrowly escaping the down smash here in Dream. Still fighting for his life. Ooh. What a turnaround for smash. Punish your own reach. Wow. I mean, that's exactly what you need it, though. I want to say this is even based off of Doc's damage output and how early you can kill Game & Watch. Oh, most definitely. Like, it's for sure one thing that Monty has to always consistently be aware of. Is like, if I don't have Mario off the stage or if I'm not punishing him for uh, his aerials, then there's a good opportunity Dream will slowly come back. He almost got a last game. Ooh, getting that forward air really good for Monty. Nice. Oh, oh for the jab one. I thought he was going to get the free jab off stage. Okay. Wow, there, and then there. good double fair there and oh. opening up the shield down tilt. No yep. up beat. Not the sweet oh, spot. Crazy. That was cool. That was very crazy indeed. It might cost him, honestly. What? What? No, and what? What happened? Yeah. What happened, Monty? You were doing fine. Wait, what? <laughs> uh, <huh>? <laughs> uh, <laughs> Maybe he's just giving the people what they want, man. Throwing out a homie stock, and it's like, yeah, man. You know what? Let me get this game, game three with Dream. I don't know what that was. I don't know how he died, uh, and why he died. But Dream. Definitely takes that. <laughs> He's not complaining about that. I don't think a Dr. Mario will lose any sleep over a... Whoa, what was that? That was, you uh, know, open up on my video on my Twitter. <laughs> I was like, I was scrolling. I was like, I had Twitter open on my phone and I didn't notice. Oh. <laughs> uh, anyway. But, um... Yeah, I don't think a Dr. Mario's gonna lose any sleep over Game & Watch SDing on his last stock. <laughs> okay, but because of that uh, strange SD, we're getting the Game 3 here. And uh, honestly, Dream's playing pretty well. Monty's playing well too. I... I don't know, I would say this is a toss-up who's gonna take this last game here. Three, 
Let's see. Did we get the Smashville pick? Yep, that yep. is going to be Smashville here. Oh uh, yeah, Smash will be very good for Game Watch, especially once he gets these juggles. And, like if he if he lures you into the middle platform when he has a juggle situation, he can get so much damage. It can be so hard to avoid. And honestly, he might just be dead here. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> he never got his jump back. Uh, Monty is just completely harassing Doc's uh, exploitable recovery. Oh, here I mean, we go. The that's big the combos. Thing, that's gonna say like that's the thing about Game Watch too. If you're not ready, Game Watch has. I wouldn't say necessarily Game Watch is one of the best characters to do it, but Game Watch is a character that, that can juggle you and force you off to the stage at the edges. And unfortunately, if you're not a character with good recovery like Dr. Mario, man, you might be in a rough spot here. But the Dream has a lot to fight for. Goes for the down tilt. Not much afterwards here, but he's got the ledge. There is, I think that's what Dream is looking for. A situation where you can punish Monty on the landing. Because he's constantly hunting for him. He'll go for pill and then he'll get back to the ground and looking to see how Monty will land here. But unfortunately, the only thing that the only player that has gotten the up smash consistently has been Monty. Oh. And unfortunately, in that situation, Monty will get the down smash, the berry as well. And he's at three stocks here to dreams to one. This is rough. Yeah, I mean, he had to, this, he had to make a comeback last time, but it was only from a one stock deficit. Two old stock deficit. I don't know. He's gonna have to dig real deep here. Big nerf from the ledge. That's so much percent for Game Watch. Oh, catches the roll in. Dreams under a lot of pressure right now. Struggling to land too. Don't even know if he got his jump back. He didn't, so he was forced to air dodge. And Monty's covering that as well. Oh, the way that Monty's just been getting these smashes with the ledge. It's kind of, if I were a Dream, I would just kind of slow the roll here and like slowly, casually approach the center stage here because there's a lot of aggression that you're seeing dream just constantly going for rolls monty finally gets the back here downer that'll Ooh. definitely not do no, it no, just not yet, dead, but really good edge guard here i was gonna say yeah if Mon monkey monty can still get the edge guard here but it's only if he messes messes up opportunities here so he's still looking for a couple forward is here definitely looking to catch oh. the last i was gonna say green He's got a lot to fight for, but unfortunately that down there will take it and Monty ladies and gentlemen moves up 2-1 against Dream. Yeah. Mr. Moving on in the bracket. Dream trying his best to make it happen with Doc, but 